Hey guys, so I got my wisdom teeth out like 26 hours ago, and I kind of don't remember a lot of the experience, because I was knocked the fuck out, but um, there was one moment where I woke up and I asked a dentist if this was an alien abduction. He's like, no, 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 you're fine, you're fine. But I had like a weird dream that I was like in an alien spaceship when I was knocked out, so that was interesting. Um, my face is kind of poofy right here, and it hurts really bad right there. And my mom's into like this essential oil stuff, so she made me some essential oils for that. And I basically been living off of ice cream and applesauce and water for like a while. Um, can't drink Pepsi at all for some reason. They won't let me. Um, you probably saw the videos of me stoned already that my dad filmed. His phone died around that time, so he didn't get to videotape the whole thing, but apparently every time the secretary in the other room's phone rang, I'd yell, answer the damn phone. And they kept trying to put me on my side, and I kept rolling over on my stomach, on my back. And the Tylenol 3s are making me kind of high. And I can't really talk very well for some reason. I think it's because my face is all frozen. And my dad got me a chocolate milkshake. And I tried drinking it and got it all over my shirt because my face was too frozen. So my sister thought that was funny. But hopefully this heals soon because it's really not fun at all. I think it will heal soon, because I have family coming over this weekend, so kind of can't be dealing with this shit. But it's weird, because only one side hurts. The other three teeth don't hurt. Just this one teeth. This one tooth. But I have this thing where my my roots are longer than the average human. <laughs> so I have really, really long roots on these things, on these teeth. And that's kind of not really normal. Yeah. The dentist is really nice, so he's a really good looking guy. He's like 30 probably, though. The Tylenol 3s are making like air the world spin here, like the, the room spinning weird. So that's interesting. I had a really good sleep last night, though. I slept like a baby until about 5 o'clock in the morning there. It's all good. I had to clean it with the strands and some salt water. Hope it doesn't get infected because my cousin got his infected really bad too and that's not good. I don't know. It was a really weird experience and I was extremely nervous going into it because I thought it was going to be more painful than it was. It It is painful but it's not like as painful as I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like horribly painful. My mom wants me to cut the grass today, which I'm going to refuse to do because there's no way in hell I'm cutting grass today. Because I'm all like weird. And everything hurts funny. Like all this jawbone here hurts really bad. I haven't even put my tongue back there to feel the stitches because I'm too scared to. <laughs> so it, it was an interesting experience. Kind of don't ever want to do it again. But a lot of people were nervous getting their teeth out, and I was too, but it turned out to be fine, I guess. I'm kind of just rambling here. Like, it's so weird. I'm still stoned from those Tylenol 3s. Like, I don't, I don't even know anymore, man. Like, it's not it's so weird. And to make everything worse, Jim Myers died yesterday, too. I'm gonna have my teeth out. People say that you're not supposed to have dreams when you're knocked out, but I had the weirdest dreams ever. Like, I was dreaming about colors and stuff, and then I dreamed that I was, like, in the alien spaceship. Like, it was weird. 
and then last night was I had the best sleep ever, man. So anyway, I'm gonna go now. So this is 25 hours after getting my teeth out. Hopefully it doesn't hurt tomorrow, but it probably will. Bye bye.